All right. If we want the customer to give us, which is our asking price, a deeply discounted price, I might add, would it be a good idea to remind them of all the value yes. that we're asking them to pay for? Okay? Yet, nobody does it. You guys didn't do it. Nobody in Midlothian did it. Nobody in South Carolina did it. Nobody in L.A. did it. Nobody in Texas did it. Because we're not trained to do it. If I buy this ramp, I get the truck, right? What else do I get? What other value comes with the truck? We don't think about it, but it's value. Let's put it this way, Zach. Um, Zach, I look at you and I say, okay, I appreciate that nine grand, Zach, but how about you knock off another $2,834? We'll make it even 30000 and you say, okay, Steve, shoot, I think we can do that. Let me go talk to my manager, and I'll bet you he'll knock off another 2800 for you. However, you're not going to get the 3636 comprehensive warranty, nor are you going to get the five-year, 60,000-mile powertrain. Is that okay with you? How many people are going to do that deal? So it's worth at least $2,800 then, isn't it? Why don't, we, why, don't we, why don't we remind them that they're not going to be paying for an auto, a truck repair in this case? for the foreseeable future. Why don't we remind them of that? Because it's not the way we've been trained. What else do I get? I get a, I get a 560 powertrain, I get a six or 336 comprehensive. What else do I get with this truck? Are you pretending to I, I'm, We're gonna get the wooden advantage oh, in just a second, but I'm, not, I'm talking just from Chrysler now. What else do I get? Roadside assistance? I get three years, 36,000 miles of roadside assistance. Is that, is that what I get? Yeah. Okay, my car is out of warranty right now. I pay seven bucks a month for roadside assistance. So there is a dollar value that you can attach to this, correct? Yes. Yeah. Okay, if someone doesn't get it from Chrysler, they're going to have to pay for it. Allstate, AAA, on their insurance, on their physical damage insurance, mobile phone offers a roadside assistance now. You'd be stunned at the number of people who are paying for roadside assistance on their physical damage insurance bill and don't know it. You'd be stunned at the number of people paying for it on their mobile phone bill and they don't know it. But they don't need to do that if they buy this truck, do they? No. Okay, what else? Safety. Say again? Safety about dealing with different like Okay, that's, that's, uh, that's too abstract. So the, it's, right, it's right, but it's too abstract. So you have the 911 button, you've got the assist button. Serious radio. Okay. Free the, for a year. Oh, okay. Okay. Serious. Okay. Hold. Hold on. Serious radio free for a year. Okay. If I don't get it free, how much is Serious radio? Ten bucks. About twelve. 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 You, you know, so twelve times twelve is one hundred forty-four dollars. Um, do you drink? And so, do, 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 I mean, do you buy this or is it bullshit? Do these things have value? Yeah. Why aren't we, if, if we want them to pay us 32834 why aren't we reminding them of this value? I know what you're thinking. Well, Steve, I told them about it when I was doing the vehicle presentation. I told them all about the warranties. Um, Dustin, do customers hear everything we say? No. Do they retain everything we say? No. Absolutely not. Customers are really good at looking you dead in the eye and not hearing a goddamn word you're saying because they're trying to figure out what they're going to say next. Okay? So, does it make sense to remind them of the things that they're going to get that have tangible, dollar, quantifiable Budget. value? Thank you. Yes. <clears throat> okay. Um, what else are they going to get? Let's throw, now let's throw in the wit and advantage. They're going to get a... Uh, Learn a car. Loan a car for well, the next four years. years. First four years. Okay. Free state inspections. Free state inspections. What state is, what's the How state? Eight, 16, what, 16 bucks. 16, 16 times five. five. Keep my car five years. It's, eight, it's $80. 80, 80 bucks. Is that for the first one? Carry the two. No, if, I keep, if, I only keep my, if I only keep my vehicle for five years, it's $80 worth of state inspections I get. Hey, if someone had given me 80 bucks last night and said, here, we'll take, take care of your state inspections for the next five years, I would have liked them. Okay, well, what else? Don't I get a 10 year, 10 year 200,000 mile powertrain warranty? Where's it good? Anywhere in the United States. All right, and would it, 
makes sense to just mention to the customer that, remember, you saw the great internet price, that's what brought you here, and that's the price that you're going to see on the other side of this piece of paper, because I never ever walk out unless the paper's folded. Because when you put that paper down in front of the customer, you've lost control of the process, just like that. Why? Because their eyes are focused on the paper. They're not hearing what you're saying. They're, they're, they're figuring out what they're going to say to you, okay? They're, they're, they're looking at them damn payments right there. All right, you're, you're talking about this square or that square or this square, and they're, and they're focused in on those payments. And by the time you get here, they're going, that's going to be just a little too much here, my friend. Go back to your little wizard, wizard of eyes up there behind the desk and get me a lower payment. You don't want to lose control of the process. Keep the paper like this, and you're going to notice. I'm going to do this quick because speed is important. I'm going to recap all the value that comes with this truck. <clears throat> I'm going to make sure the dude wants the truck. I'm going to ask him about that first and foremost. And then every time I say something, I'm going to write it down. I mean, when I say write it down, I'll, I'll do 36, 36. That's your comprehensive warranty. What that means is you're not going to pay for an automobile repair for the next three years, 36,000 miles. And then boom. Why do, I, why, do, why do I write it down even though I'm saying it? So they can focus on it. I'm doubling my power of communication. Now the people are hearing it and they're seeing it. Okay? All right. And I'm going to remind him that he can't pay too much. I want the I want you look. What's the customer's What's the customer's state when you bring the numbers out to them? Well, they're scared. Uh, they're yeah, they're defensive, they're worried, they're concerned, they're skeptical. They're All right, wall is up. We need we need to, we we need to break it down. We we need to make we need to make this very non-confrontational. Like I'm not going to get into objection handling today, but if you watch my video. 